Well, like I was just saying before, that this is Atlast. Yep. It's a really scary game. A little normal. Uh, okay. So your mind's up sure you're an investigative reporter. Basically, you can't fight. This is Dad. You know the game. Remember Alien Isolation? This one's a better version of Alien Isolation. I say that because at the end of the day, Alien Isolation was kind of boring. Mostly boring, yes. New is fine. Cat? Didn't hear him purring. Right next to me, purring. Yeah, he's a purring. And that this game, I'm afraid we're not gonna have much chances to kick a mother down. We're gonna try. If you could run them over, you'd probably beat the game within five seconds. Maybe not. They're pretty. These these people in this thing are pretty crazy. So mass ma massive um, Mount Massive Asylum is a mental hospital. But it's going kind of dark. Like you haven't had much. Uh, people haven't had much like uh, uh, communications with them for a while. So we're going up there to investigate. Yes. Now most of this game takes place with a video camera. If you have a video camera. You record stuff. You can see in the dark with a yeah, with a light. This is fairly old. Uh, you don't, you don't know me. You have to make this quick. Th there might be monitoring. I did two weeks of software consulate at Murkoff Psycho uh, Psychi Psychiatric Systems Facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs. <laughs> yeah, people were breaking out. Stuff happened. It's been a crazy place. Uh, people heard blah blah blah. People heard blah blah. There's my camera. There's me batteries. So we're taking a look at a little uh, camera that takes batteries and stuff. This is our lifeblood, this thing right here. This is the game. That if you were if you saw this building, would you go into this thing? Alright. This button these button leans. This button picks up and drops my camera. I'm sure there'll be a button to tell me. I think it, yeah, there's a there's a duck button. It's the B button. I don't press something. I can jump slightly. Yeah. Is there a re Is it? Look, it's an Xbox One. No, don't uh, stop listening. The Xbox One heard me. What button runs? Oh, this button. Okay. Just open the door quickly. Press X. Open the door slowly. Press it and hold it. Enemies can hear stuff. They can hear sounds and things. They can hear a door slam open. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. Mount Massive Asylum just sh shut down in scandal. Amid scandal and government uh, secrecy in, uh, in 1971. Reopened by Murkoff Psychi Psychiatric Systems in 2009 under the guise of a... Whatever. It's a bunch of stuff. But that's time to, to break into this place. I'm sure it'll work out. Well, look at all these military vehicles. That's probably good, right? <laughs> I'm sure the psycho... I'm sure the people inside would love, love that. Maybe. Whoops.
figure out what button makes. Oh, there it is. So right now we ha now we have two buttons. I mean, we have two batteries right now. See that at the top? That little button right there. Those little things. That's how many batteries you have. Now uh, you use battery when you go in when you go um yeah, dark vision or whatever. Try this door. What do you think? This door's gonna open? Nope. Nah, nah. No one's gonna come after me yet. Alright, you can zoom. Oh, they're people. There's no, like, sight. There's no, um, supernatural stuff in this game. This is a very, uh, advanced t uh, uh, camcorder for one that. Uses batteries to work. It's a pretty good thing. Yeah. Let's go further into this place. Sounds like a good idea to me, right? Uh, it looks safe. That music sounds incredibly safe. Ah. A is basically to do everything. This is our vision, Dad. Yeah, yeah, do you like the Blair Witch? Yeah. Um, the battery's gone. The television. You can also close doors. But if you don't push it down, it'll close the door real hard. Good sign, isn't it? Oh, I'm walking around looking to invest. I'm an investigator. I'm investigating. This game is terrifying. <laughs> but I was a person, clearly. I'm looking for batteries to make sure I don't miss any of them. I probably have already. Oh, look, a little light. Oh, there we go. Battery. You can hold up to ten on normal. If I push Y, I'll reload the battery, but I'll use up I'll use up a full battery just to do it. So you don't want to use up the battery until you're basically done with it, or the battery dies. Me personally, I think it would have been a better idea to not have batteries. Like, to just have it that the camera is near your thing. Because it seems very limited to me. I mean, do you want to read this? I kind of don't want to sit there and read these things. Uh huh. Ah, oh, Billy. Well, the computers are still. Oh, well, kinda. I don't think we had the password. What do you think? Well, let's close the door. Gotta be polite, right? That was a person. Well, the door's just closing, you see that? Oh. Don't think we're going that way. Your face. <laughs> Your face. I can tell this is a game that's just going to get you. I know that. Because I'm not going to say a word. I know where the scares are, Dad. I know where they are. When things come bumping at the night. Ah! 
he screamed before he died. He fell with his head, without his head. Look, you don't have a head, Dad. He screamed? Did my character scream? Who screamed? Well, this guy don't have a head either. Yeah, I don't think this is a good. I don't think this is a good place. Go my way. Look, Dad, heads. Battery in here somewhere? Batteries are glow, right? <laughs> they killed us! You got out! The Varians! You can't fight them! You have to hide! You can unlock the main doors! For security control! <laughs> You have to get the fuck out of this terrible place! They did a- they did a number on people, huh? I think I was recording something and I messed up by taking off the chart and taking it off the um... Oops. You can hide in dr you can hide in different things. Also, they can't really see in the dark too well, but they can hear pretty well. I will eventually meet Chris. Chris is uh, look dead. Yeah, this game has a lot of blood and gore, and very uh, not good with batteries. Oh, this is where that one guy came in. Well, should I open the door? <laughs> that door is locked. That door is impassable. Let's crawl through here. Little fake. <laughs> <laughs> Characters in the game is actually a merciful friendly. God. You have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. That we already met Chris. That big guy that threw us through the window. That was Chris Walker. Chris is not very friendly. I think that that's a that's father. I forget his name. He'll eventually tell us. Dude. This guy didn't have a good day. Oh! oh. What? Huh. I slipped on top of the thing, huh? That's... Okay. <laughs> I don't think that's supposed to be up here, Dad. <laughs> oh, breaking the game. Already. We got ourselves a little note. Uh-huh. Imminent danger, uh, environment contamination. Well, it'd be pretty weird to die in the very first seconds of the game, wouldn't it? I don't have the, don't have the camera up. I'm just looking for batteries, making sure I don't miss any. we go. I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna do that a lot. Jump while I'm trying to pick up the battery up. Because I'm used to X being the, con the uh, confirm button. See how, see how quickly the batteries drain, though? Yeah, my... No, that one's... This is the exit, by the way. We're almost out, Dad. Well, I can't. The doors are locked. How can I get out when the doors are locked? Oh, this guy still has his head. Hey, it's a radio. There's something wrong with that radio. What's going on with that radio? This is a pointless room. Like, what was the point of this room? Like, even before, like, they were throwing stuff, did they take everything out of the room? No, 
Now, I'm not just running around for no reason looking for stuff, you know. Making sure I'm not missing no, uh, no uh, batteries and things so you can see in the dark. Because when you run out of batteries, you can't see in the dark anymore. You're stumbling around in the dark. It's not very fun. Yeah, there was a lot of people didn't make it. You can hide in lockers. Some more notes. Mm -hmm. uh, therapy and stuff like that. Some batteries over here in your computer. Just a bunch of computers that just have password on them. person in a wheelchair. I mean, I can see him. I can see him just fine. Well, he moved. He's still alive. He's not doing so hot, though. Don't got no eyes, Dad. Whoa, I can't see anything. Oh, we already did. We, this is Chris. This is talking about Chris Walker. See, Chris Walker. That's that dude, the big guy. Should've... Yeah, I'm walking right. Th they're, they're watching a. They're watching a movie right now, Dad. Yes, yes, they are. Hey, some of them are friendly, but uh, some of them aren't friendly. You'll know the difference very quickly. Certainly chase you. You got me. I got me a key card. Hello? Can I? Can't open the phone. My my objective is to escape the asylum. My original objective was to get in the asylum, now to escape it. He's only been here for five or six minutes. Hello, buddy. Got a duck. I'm gonna waste a lot of time because I'm always gonna push the uh, this button to duck. That's how it most of the time is. Um, maybe they do. They just they're just content. Get them out! Please! The dungeon is clean! Yeah, like I said, not all the people in this thing are, are aggressive are uh, dangerous, but they are kinda crazy. They all slip again. One of those games where you just, like I, I just gotta loot, you know? Because I wanted to see a reaction. Yeah, I already slipped on top of the thing. I'm not sure how that works. You can look behind you when you're running, Dad. He didn't seem very happy. No, that's a different... The dude in the wheelchair is gone, Dad. He's never going to become an enemy yet again. He was just trying to get me to help him. That is the only way he knew how. By tackling me. He didn't want to attack. He didn't want to hurt me. He just wanted me to help him. He did. Witness. I don't think he made it, Dad. Another hand in the, hand in the toilet. By the way, there's body parts in there. See him? Should we go investigate that one room? Ah, oh, 
Project Wall Rider. Sounds fun. He rides the wall, all right. Oh, there'll be a point in this game where I'm not going to be running around anymore. Why should we have to pay for it? Why do we have to die? Walker will kill us just for being sick. For some people, huh? We didn't choose this! So, uh, remember that big guy, the one who threw us the thing? He's going around pulling people's heads off. This is where I had to go. This is the controls for the doping in the main gate. No, 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 Dad. Oh, okay. Dad, you think it's gonna be that easy? Oh, I'm, access I'm accessing the security system. I don't think... Well, that's, that's my friend, remember him? He just turned the power off. I'm in pitch black now, Dad. Well, somewhat. Hey, Dad. Well, there's a reason. They don't come in very easy. He looks for everybody. If he, if he catches you, he will pull your head off. Now we've entered the part of the game where you don't run around no more. Now he's gone, Dad. Not for long, no. He's a smart one. He's He looks stupid, but he's smart. He's pretty much your xenomorph. Mostly, yeah. But the thing is, he's not the only enemy in this game. I don't think I've ever... I don't think there's a part in the game where you can fight him and another enemy at the same time. Oh, they'll attack you. They're crazy. I'm pretty sure he would if he could. Now we're in the part of the game that this is very, very scary now. There's an, there will be an active enemy. Again, you can only run and hide. You cannot fight them. This isn't like Alien Isolation where you can shoot certain enemies. There are no enemies in this game you can shoot. Also, I have a limited inventory. I have a limited uh, power source. How do I stand up again? Let's be. Who's, who's there? I had to turn this pot, this pump on. That's gonna get me killed eventually. <coughs> I keep pushing X when I want to when I put want to open or do something. Uh oh, what a music starting up. It's 
one button. There's two or three buttons in the game. This area. You hear it? normal every dude every, every day guy that wasn't Chris Walker at all that was just another guy oh wow If he'd have seen me, he would have chased, he would have ran after me. Uh, I eventually have to get somewhere. bed over there I can hide. Hello. Doctor. My daddy saw me. I can't run. How do I run? I don't like the, the, the battery system of this game. I don't know which way I came in, Dad. Did I come from this way? Electric room's this way, so... I can see slightly. Gonna get me killed because I keep pushing the wrong button to get out to collect an item. But we're not gonna make that mistake again. Make sure I know where I'm gonna hide once this guy comes in. Because pressing that button makes a lot of noise.
well, in this game's sake, I guess. They have a tendency of coming towards the source of noise. Like, he's gonna come in this room eventually. I probably shouldn't have closed the door. Because the door is my safety net. In case he does find me and come after me again. No, the, the door I closed. But then again, it'll let me know when he's coming or not. When he's here. So what do you think so far of this game? Where would you run? You're in, you're blocked in now. Oh. He's coming. He's knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door here, Dad. He's in. Should I go and greet him? One of those things, I really wish I could just leave this on the, on this mode all the time, but it just drains your battery so quickly. I almost pushed X. I almost pushed X. <laughs> he would he would thump me for sure, and I'd, I'd have to run away from him like I did before. That's a good question. I don't know where he is. I have to go back to the front. I pushed all the buttons. Well, I can get the electricity back on. Yeah, I pushed all three buttons. If there's a fourth one, then I'm in trouble. Because I have to go back into this area. <laughs> I'm sure he's gone, right? Back, Dad. No, if he saw you, he would have heard the music. But he's coming back this way. Oh. Well, he's, he's in the room. Hear him. He just opened the gate next he just opened the locker next to me. He came he doubled back. Hopefully not. He was gone. I mean I can't see him regardless. Unless the locker's pointed at the doorway, I can't see him. Way. I need the. Well, he's got to leave. I can't run into him. Even though I could probably body check him into the floor or something. If I attacked him from behind, I could probably knock him out. But I can't attack. No, that's not a thing. This is an alien isolation. You can't bop them in the head. They're all considered xenomorphs in this game. See, the thing is, he might have just turned back around again. That's the problem with this game. You don't know. There's no, there's no um, thing to check where who's moving around or not. Because the door is gone. He could be in the room right this second. How would I know? Now, if you kneel, if you walk like this, you would make less sound. <laughs> Just jumped at it. Now, which way do I go? I came from this room, right? Light is bad.
This door is closed. That's probably not a good That would dead end. That's a dead end, Dad. The battery, she's running out. Is that him right there? Who is that? Oh, yes, there is. Here goes my light. It's um infrared light or whatever. That light that sees in the dark. He might have just gone right past this room. He didn't see me. I mean, what do you think? You have to admit what these guys are seeing when you're walking around like this. Like you're walking around with a guy. There's a guy walking around with a camera in his face. You hear him. Walking around out there. I got five batteries. Did I put a loaded one in there? I don't know what he I don't know if he's left or not. Hello, buddy. Okay. I just, I think I just saw him walk by. Just right over there. See, now I'm all turned around. Hi, everybody. Okay. How do I get up? How do I get up? I can't get out of this area, Dad. He won't let me. I'm so turned around, I can't figure out how to get out of here. I keep getting back into this dead end room because he won't leave. 